time to stop grammar time. Today we are going to be doing Kids Try Foods. MREs. So, today we're going to try a couple things because um, we had them around and we're getting rid of them. But I wanted the girls mm -hmm. to try out the MREs. A little bit of everything, just because. We've got chili with beans. We've got chicken with pasta in pesto sauce, beef stew, and cheese tortellini vegetarian. So, girls. Oh, also, it does come with the, the heater pack. I'm not going to use that in the house. I mean, I could demonstrate it for one of these that they're probably not going to like. Do it for the chili because you're probably not going to eat that. But everything else I'm going to heat up in the microwave and let you guys see how they like it. You guys ready to try them? Ready! Let's do this. Alright, so first things first, I'm going to go ahead and open up these packets. Oh shit, it's got a little tear. That's pretty neat. Okay. Just so you guys can see what these look like on the inside. So, normally these go in the cool little pouch that heats it all up. Ooh, man. Ooh, this looks so good. Look at that. Does that look yummy? No. No. <laughs> I think that one is the chicken pesto. Just all pressed in there. Yep. I don't need water for that one. You don't need water for that one? In case it's spicy. Mm. It shouldn't be spicy. They don't make them too spicy. So a lot of times what they did back when I was in basic training is they had a tiny itty bitty bottle about this big of Tabasco sauce. And that was your seasoning for everything. And it was the best. So, mmm, that tastes good, actually. A little basil in it. Um, I might just have to eat that by myself. Um, but no, the nice thing about MREs is you can actually eat them cold, too. So if you don't have time to heat it up, you can just eat it cold. All right, this one is our beef stew. Ooh. You want to see that one? Beef stew. Got some carrots in there and some beef. Check that one out. Ooh, yum. Oh yeah, and potatoes. Oh yeah, nice little oh, MPs. Mm mm mm. <laughs> and last but not least, well, for the ones I know the girls will probably try, is the cheese tortellini, because they love having cheese ravioli. Ooh, oh, this one's in tomato sauce. They might not try it. I think you girls still should though. Okay. Okay, just the little tortellinis. I mean, it just looks like. Chef Boyardee kind of food. You'll be fine, I promise. You don't have to eat the whole thing. I just want you girls to try them. I don't want to. You don't want to? Or you do want to? I don't want to. You don't want to. Okay, so I've got those. I'm going to set these off to the side for right now. And then I'm going to take our chili. And what you do is you take your little pouch here. So I've actually got instructions on there. So. Tear the top off. Oh, my hands are all greasy now. So brought the scissors out. All right. Okay. So you tear the top off. Just open the thing if I can. Again, fingers are greasy from all that food. Just. Okay. Come on. Open. There it goes. Okay. 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 Alright, then add your food into there, into the pouch. And it's got this cool heating element down here. You can't see it too well. But once it gets water in there, it has an exothermic reaction, something like that. And it heats the food up. Stop kicking Sorry, that, Dad. please. <laughs> okay, so once you do that, put it to about right here with water. Fold that over and you hold it like that with the heating element on the bottom so it gets all the water on there. Then, as it says on the instructions, after a minute of doing that, it starts to feel warm. You set it up on a rock or something. Look that one up. It's kind of funny. There's a whole story to that one. But you set it on a rock or something and you leave it like that for about 10 to 15 minutes. Be careful. It does produce steam. It is very hot. Be careful. And after that, this again, it's got another little strip there, and you can pull your food out again. 
It is hot. Be careful. So, well, I'm going to put these in the microwave. I'm going to let this one cook, so we'll see how this goes. Yay! Yay! All right. So, let me go ahead and start making this one up. So, again, keep getting them tall here. Got focused on the kids and so you can see the counter. So I got a little bottle of water. Okay. Again, we're going to put a little bit of water in here. Do not overfill. I water. Because that's what makes it work. A little bit more. Can I try that? No, because I got it now. Okay. So again, fold it over. Okay. Okay, and then we're going to put it in the box. Okay. okay, and then you set it like this so the water gets on it, gets all activated. You guys will see it here in a second, it'll start steaming and stuff, hopefully, if it's not broken. So we've had them for a little while. Here in a little bit. Right here. Listen, real close. A little bubble. It's making a little bit of bubbling sounds. Not too much. If like, we held it really close to the camera, then they'd be able to see it. They'd probably be able to hear it too, but for the sake of time, we'll just do that. But yeah. So, again, that should start steaming here in just a little bit. Right. So, I'm going to set that one there. We might be able to see it steam here in a second. So, I warmed up the other food. Got some spoons for you girls. Let's try some foods. Okay. Alright. Got our beef stew, our tortellini, and our chicken pesto with pasta. Alright. What do you want to try first, Poppy? I'll let you pick the first one. You just pick one, baby. I and know. you're gonna try it. Let's let sister pick real quick. What do you want to try, Pop? I don't know. Do you want to try the cheese tortellinis? That's what I want. The one right in the middle? Okay, let's try them. Let's scoop up one and let's try it. Mm. Just try it, Pops. It's fine. It's just cheese tortellinis. Watch. Where's the red sauce? It's the tomato sauce. Just eat. Yep. You said you were gonna try. Tomatoes. You said you were gonna try. Please try a bite. Mm. This is what we get all the time. I like it. Sammy likes it. It's good. Can you try it? Sister tried it. Come on. Mm. Try one. I'm just gonna <laughs> take another. Okay. Mm. You're not getting any dessert if you don't try it. Try one. Mm. It comes with two desserts. Yep, and so the nice thing with MREs is they come with crackers, usually like a cake. Mm -hmm. Just try it, Pop. Just try it. No. Poppy, just try it. Do not spit that. No. No. Chew it up and eat it. Come on. You'll be just fine. Stop. Stop. Something else. Mm hmm. Chew, chew, chew. You will eat it. You're gonna try things. Can't pick up your spoon. You're still using it. Alright. So, Sammy liked the tortellinis. Poppy, not so much. There you go, now it's cleaned off. You'll be fine. Alright, now try the beef stew next. Yeah. Alright. Ooh, potatoes and beef, peas and carrots. They usually like vegetables. Mmm. That's some good beef. I hope he's beef too. There you go. Did you try a piece of beef too? How was it? See, MREs aren't that bad. Good girl. Alright, try a piece. Try a little bit of potatoes and beef. That's all the white spots in there, baby. That's potatoes. I don't like potatoes. 
You eat french fries and tater tots and mashed potatoes. You eat potatoes. You like them. Please yeah. try one. French fries are actually potatoes, so we had them at the bowling alley today. You ate potatoes in the bowling alley. I love my kids. They're the greatest. Mm, my sister. Can you try a piece potato. of potato? Can you try a piece of beef then? Is the brown thing? Yes, that's a piece of beef. Scoop it up. Do y'all have trouble with your kids eating stuff like this? I don't know what it is. Just everything. Oh, it's yucky. You haven't even tried it. Try it, please. Okay? Eat it. It's a piece of beef. You like beef. I love it. She loves it. See? She gives me all that grief, and she loves it. Can you try a potato, too? I tried, I tried too hard. It was good too, Sammy? Uh -huh. Yeah? All right. Shall we move to the last one for you girls? Chicken pesto? Um, With noodles? All right. Noodles? Wait, it's got noodles in it. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Got chicken in there. Some noodles with a pesto sauce. Mmm, noodles. Yep. Yeah. And it's got some peppers in there too, but they're off to the side. Mmm. It's not bad. I've had better. Yeah. Sammy says it's good. Poppy, you want to try a bite? It's delicious. Here, try a bite of noodle. Try a bite. Yeah. I don't think she likes it. <laughs> so my kids have a rating system of thumbs up and thumbs downs. Yeah, is that good? Why are they please? <laughs> okay. All right. Ooh. Ooh. Now you can really hear it. Feel it? Feel the warmth? It's warm now, isn't it? Oh, man, I can actually hear it from here. Yeah. Let's see if I can get it over here and you can hear it. I can kind of hear it. Whoa. So, so that means right now the chili is cooking. Mmm. Mm. So normally, like I said, it would be about 10, 15 minutes that it would be cooking in there. Really depending on like the temperature outside. Can that is. Have the dessert? Can we now have the dessert? Is it, the dessert is supposed to be last, Poppy. Poppy, put down the M&Ms. Always into everything. So anyway, do you, hey, will you try the corn or the uh, chili with beans? Yes. Beans Sammy are disgusting. Okay. Beans I, disgusting. You I've eat had, beans. I've had chili on a hot dog and I liked it. You had chili on a hot dog and you liked but it. But I had no beans. And I like beans, so probably them mixed together. I like it. Okay. Well, Daddy's gonna pull it out. We'll see how much steam comes out of here. Again, be careful with these things because they will be hot. Usually. Wait, and one of them, mm -hmm. I only tried it. So, thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This one's not producing too much steam, so. It should it's be warm. warm. It's a little warm. It should we can be take this right one out. So we did it right. It's not too terrible. That is good. Alright. I'm going to set this off to the side. Let's see how our beans turned out. Ooh, they're a little warm. They're not too bad. But you gotta knead it around just very gently. Just make sure the heat circulates through it. And don't and make sure you don't smush them. Don't smush the beans. So you do it. So do it very, very, very carefully. Very, very, very carefully. You can okay. smush them. That's okay. Yep, yeah, just like refried beans. They're smushed, aren't they? Yeah. Okay. Let's see what these beans look like here. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, those beans look nice. Oh. Look at that chili. Oh. That looks like some high quality. That's military grade chili right there. Ooh, yeah. Oh, you ready to dig in, Sammy? Mmm. 
Ooh, and it smells really good too. Can I smell it? No, you don't want to try it. Yes, you can smell it. But don't want to try it. Here, smell it. That smells mm. good, doesn't it? All right, Sammy, do it again. It kind of smells like a toot. <laughs> it smells like a toot. <laughs> Is it that good? Well, there you have it. And beans do not make you too. Mm -hmm. But beans sometimes make you too. Mm. Because we, because one day my mom and dad ate all lots of beans. But me and Sam were tooting a lot. But we didn't eat the beans. So was mom and dad ate the beans. They didn't. But they were tooting. A lot. A like lot. all day. I did a big toot. Mm-hmm. Big toots. I right. do. Mine's are like... So, we tried the main entrees with the tortellini, the beef stew, the chicken, and the chili. If you would want to try the side items that go with it, like the crackers and the cornbread. Mm-hmm. And that's yeah. it. Yeah! Okay. Thumbs up for both. All right. Let me clean this up, and we'll try those next. All right, so now that we tried the entrees, I went ahead and got the crackers out, which are in these little vacuum sealed packages. Got a nutritious energy bar. I've uh, got some banana nut ranger bar. You know what, I'm gonna open up the banana nut ranger bar because I wanna know, is it like banana bread? Why not? Oh, oh yeah, nice. A little crunchy bar, here. Here, I'll give you small pieces here. Try those, try a bite. <laughs> so I'm just giving them little bits of these I'm not making them eat the whole thing because an MRE technically is a full meal for a soldier um, that they can just eat in one day they're not eating the whole entire thing I mean I've still got the plates of food they're not finished I'm not trying to overfeed my kids I promise just in case you're watching wife. anyway okay so hey that was pretty good. You liked it? Mm -hmm. you. So good. Got a little crunch to so it. Double fudge. Not bad. Mm -hmm. No. Like I said, you're not eating the whole entire thing. Sorry. Stinker butts. Ooh. Oh. And we have a piece of cornbread with the uh, little packet on there to keep it fresh. It's a little flat. A little sad. But you know what? It's still good. It's okay. I'm gonna break off a little piece there. Try it. Mm. Would that go good with the uh, chili? Mm -hmm. Okay. Especially if you dip it. Yeah. Ooh, if you dip it in there. Mm. Mm. Oh. Especially if you dip it into the sauce. Mm-hmm. All right. What do we want to try next? Do we want to do the crackers? Do you want the cheese spread on it? Yes, cheese. Yes, cheese. Let's cheese. The cheese spread. Ew, I want mine cheese spread. You want cheese spread, yes? No, I don't. I don't. Or there's also like a cheese spread with jalapenos. 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 So the crackers are really brittle. <laughs> like breaking pieces off. But they're decent. All right. I'll take I'm going to give you guys half. Right here. Stop. I'm gonna give you a little bit of cheese. I want yeah. cheese. Can I give you a little bit of cheese? <laughs> here. Okay. No, man. Stop. Ooh. Hmm? It's always good to have a pair of skizzers around. Alright. Sammy, do you want cheese on yours? Yes. Okay. I'll try it. Okay. Kind of like squeeze cheese. Squirtable cheese. Yeah. Your spoon. So you take your spoon and you just spread that out on there. Ooh, that would be nice. Yeah, just a little bit of cheese on there for her. Try that. Use your little spoon for her sisters here. I'm gonna put it right on the corner there. Okay. That's great. I'm gonna spread it around just a little bit. There you go. Try that out. Mmm. That's good cheese. It's almost like the cheese crackers, you know? Oh, like Ritz. Uh huh. You know those like cheese crackers that are a cracker and some cheese in the Kinda middle? 
and then a cracker on top. This cheese tastes exactly... Reminds you of that? Oh, that's cool. Well, mostly the cheese tastes exactly the same. But two thumbs up for a regular. Mmm. She likes it and she doesn't like it. Mm. <laughs> and then they don't like it and they don't like it. Besides the regular cheese spread, they also have jalapeno cheese spread, which gives it a little bit more kick, which I'm sure the kids won't like, but I want it. Is that okay with you? <laughs> that was so good. Oh man, that one's a little darker too. Do you have another piece of the bread? We're going to try some other things. Oh, a little darker, isn't it? Yeah, I do not want to try that. That's okay, that's for daddy. Mm -hmm. That's mine. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Not too spicy, actually. What? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's okay, a little dry, though. A little dry. But that's why you carry a canteen, you stay hydrated. Nope, I'm good. Yeah, it's better with the cheese sauce. Yep. Yeah. Alright, so this one is a multi-grain snack bread. Snack bread. Not to be confused with cornbread. And <laughs> it came with blackberry jam. Ooh, blackberry jam. Thank you for repeating that. I don't think they heard me. Blackberry jam. Poppy, I was kidding. Uh, children these days, I swear. We are children. I'm aware. And that kind of looks like poop. <laughs> kind of looks like poop. Ew. Hey, I'm not tasting poop at all. Well, are you just not going to try it at all? <laughs> I'm just saying, it looks like poop, but it's not poop. It looks like poop, but it's not poop. Actually, it looks like rice. Smushed raisins. Yeah. There was two. There you go. There you go. Try it. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Actually, they made out of raisins. It's blackberries, baby. <laughs> it's not raisins. Can I crunchy? It's good. It's good. Can I crunchy? It is not crunchy. Well, the bread's not exactly oh, super duper fresh. Oh, don't forget to your list, too. Thanks, Poppy. Not bad. Cool. See, everybody just doesn't like MREs, but they're actually not that bad. Even the kids like them. Usually. I'm the one who likes everything. Mm-hmm. All right. In the end. All right, last one. We're going to have our dessert. We're going to have some patriotic sugar cookies. Sugar cookies. What about that one? Oh. <laughs> Don't worry about that one. It's Uncle Sam. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Sam. That Turn it over. Turn it over. He's wearing a big hat. says USA. Okay, now look, pop. Oh, little Here's American the flags. Part, and then, now look. Here's the star part of it, and then mm -hmm. there's the hat and the, the face. Now yep. you see it? Now you see it. Oh, there's and the tree. Statue of Liberty torch. That's pretty yeah, cool. All right. Here you go. Try one. So yeah, I saw sugar cookies, and I'm thinking like the ones you get from Walmart. <laughs> Maybe it could be something like that. <laughs> See, we get treats occasionally. Mm. They're pretty good. Two thumbs up for the cookies. Three hundred so cookie rules. Yeah. Yep. Okay. The cookie rules. The cookie rules. But sometimes, sometimes you'd also get candy in there. Um, I was actually opening one of the bags up, and an M and M fell out of. The big bag. I was like, where'd that come from? But the, 
this is completely sealed. Who knows? All right. I thought that there was an extra one in. I thought so too. All right. So, what did you girls think of the MREs? I like them. They're pretty good when you find a meal you like. Or a good one. Yeah. All right. Okay, girls. What we need to say. Please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe to our, our channel. channel. Thanks for watching. Check out our other cool videos. Bye.